Okay, so the last part of this demonstration or contrast comparison between a Mesa Stiletto Ace Head and a Marshall JCM 2000, the DC, uh, sorry, DSL Dual Super Lead series, uh, is going to be the overdrive channel. Now, um, what I've done on the Marshall is I'm using the normal gain, not the ultra gain. When you, once you engage the ultra gain button, it's really way too much um, gain, I find. I'll, I'll show you that real quick before we do the demo. Um, here's a Marshall with um, the normal gain. Ultra gain. Disengaged, so normal gain, ultra gain. On the Mesa, we're on the, the gain channel um, and uh, we're using the tight function. Uh, there's a three way button where my finger is. Uh, the top one is crunch, it's tight in the middle and then fluid drive at the bottom. The fluid drive again is, is very intense. So I'm gonna keep that in the middle so that we have a tight setting which should sort of correspond to the normal gain of the Marshall. As in all three uh, videos, the, all the tone controls, etc., are at noon. Starting with the Mesa Boogie. for a little bit. bridge pickup on, on either of the two amps. Now switching to the uh, neck pickup, let's try some solo on starting on the Marshall. I'm sorry, starting on the Mesa Boogie. <laughs> Try higher up. <laughs> 
back to the Mesa. setting I find that the amps are probably at their closest um, tone wise still a little more brightness perhaps on the Mesa Boogie but it's getting close to the Marshall and if if I didn't leave the tone controls at noon but dialed around a little bit to find similar sounds I could dial in a tone that's pretty close on on both amps hope that uh, came across over YouTube with a Canon camcorder actually not a camcorder it's a regular camera with a video 